All right, let's fucking go. All right, here we go. Koa, what's good? You working today? If y'all don't... Okay, got you, got you. Alright, if y'all remember from last time, I'm trying to go and look and see if I can't find these materia. I just don't remember how to get back to them. Because I gotta get over here. Oh, wait. Okay. Never mind. I'm dumb. I'm slow. Alright, hold on. Let's go back over here. Right, because because we gotta. Oh, well. Um, not too far. You're dead. Like I still haven't formally met Eric yet. Like we haven't seen her since she gave Cloud that uh. That bouquet of flowers. So I'm still relatively early. Okay. Now how did I get over there again? I don't remember how I got over there. Nothing to jump on. That's a dead end. Oh, you're lying. I legitimately don't think there is another way for me to get over there. I think I'm just cooked. I don't think... No fucking way. If there is, this map ain't very helpful. <laughs> Maybe there's something down below here. Let's see. Oh shoot, you're right, you're right. Should... Or maybe not. Maybe it'll take me the other direction. Well, this isn't good. Just, I don't know, man.
Oh yeah, I still... I might have to eventually just bite the bullet. But... I was just here. I really went in a whole ass circle. That's crazy. But, yeah, I might have to bite the bullet and just play it on its own. Just because I... I'm usually not the type of person who can just jump into a franchise like I was telling uh, Jesse but uh, I really don't want to be taken forever to get into it because it takes me a really long time to complete games Mostly because I use I play a lot of different games at once, and most of the games I'm into are all super long. Like I'm still trying to beat Elden Ring. I haven't beat that yet. Um, I'm obviously playing this. It was on sale for like 30 or 40 bucks or whatever the fuck it was. So I got Storm Connections, which I've. I'm kind of eh about. Like, honestly, it's been a blast. I've been having fun with it. But. It. I also feel like it might still be too early in the game to judge. Too early in the game's life cycle. But it really does feel like stuff that could have just been DLC for Storm 4. Yeah, it really does feel like it could have been like DLC for Storm 4. But at the same time, it's also the smoothest Storm has ever felt. Like the gameplay itself is really, really fresh. I just feel like there are things that they could have done that would have added to it. I really am just going in circles at this point. You know what? Honestly, I don't even need that materia. Fuck that materia. I don't need that material. We're done. We're, we're, we're done. Why is that so far away now? How did I get that far away? <laughs> Jigen's in the game now just like as a base character and I love his kit his kit has no right to be as much fun as it is oh I hey, forgot man. anybody see a connecting catwalk let's see Like, I'm at some of my most fun when I'm playing with Jigen. And it... He has no right to be making me feel that way. Granted, as a character, I thought he was pretty neat. Like, I liked his, uh... Concept. His whole... Really, like, mad, abusive... Father shtick he was got going on. But also the fact that uh, he was just so eloquent and polite and like well-spoken and shit. 
It, it was just, it, it was great. Okay, so what do we got over here? Hmm. Although, one thing I am disappointed about is... So, something that I really liked that they brought in with... I think it was Storm 3 Full Burst. Uh, is... They'll have, like, the unique dialogue and shit for... The finishing cutscene if you finish it with a secret technique or your ultimate jutsu. They'll, uh... Thought you'd know this place by now. You'd think. Um, and there's a lot of characters they didn't really update for that. And I feel like there's some characters that should have been included more so in the base game. Like, we've got Kawaki. We've got... Uh, most of Kara, we've got like all the Kara inners. Jigen, Delta, Boro, and Kashin Koji. Uh, we don't have Amada, so I guess it's not all of them. But. Uh, we've got Momoshiki. In Kinshiki, we've got... Okay, but how the fuck do I even get to that? Like, what are we even talking about right now? Yeah, you know what? No, fuck that thing. We're done. We're gone. Bye. I'm, I'm not even gonna bother with it. Uh, but yeah, anyway, yeah, we've got Indra and Asura. Oh, you're a big Kawaki fan? I like Kawaki. Kawaki is... He is, uh... Kawaki as a character is great. Even now in the time step in Two Blue Vortex. He's still pretty cool. His kit, I think his kit's pretty fun. Do I want to go here? I don't think so. I think I want to go here. I think I want to go south. All right, do I want to go south? Or do I want to go here? What's going on here? Wait, wasn't there some material that caught your eye? You want to go grab it? Nah, no time. But um, I like Kwaki's kit. Kwaki's kit's pretty fun. Wonder what the reactor's like. Nah, I just think there should have been uh. Where they put to the plant. Like I understand why Himawari wasn't included because she wasn't even nah, really a ninja at the time that connections was yeah, being guys. made it's so the they might add her in dlc later in Bring it but on, like hagaromo isn't base game uh none none of the other generations can, or none of the other kids are in the base game Oh yeah, I just understand why they didn't, because at the time of the game, she definitely wasn't, like, she, she was not a ninja, she was not, you know. But, she definitely needs to make an appearance in the DLC, for sure. But, like, Inujin isn't in there, Chocho isn't in there. 
metally. Uh, Shake it, I. No escape. That's that. I would low key main him a worry though. As long as they don't make your kit ass. Um, they added a new jutsu for. Like, it's not a big one, but they added a new jutsu for Shisui, too. Like, it's not in. It's not a secret technique or anything, but. Alright, you're being dumb. I don't know what the hell is going on here. Damn, I guess I gotta do it my fucking self then. Time to burn. Burn. Y'all nearly Wait, fucking killed me because y'all were He's probably fucking sick irritating. About us. Maybe I should have used a high potion on him. Yes. It's not anything like super huge. Like it's not a new technique or rather a new secret technique. But it is a new jutsu and I think it's pretty neat. I'll have to... I'll have to record gameplay of it and, and uh, send it to you. good at it I wonder god I love them man Tifa it's nothing just thinking about the next step didn't think I'd be this nervous something that you never get used to yeah it's so crazy that I don't think I've met a Moogle yet in this game. Even the first time I played it, when I stopped at the fucking giant house boss, I still don't think I've met a Moogle there yet. 
I don't remember doing it at least. Mercy. Wait, Cloud. Where's Jesse and Wedge? We're yeah, about that. Top side's going nuts after some terrorists jumped off a train. Nice and quiet here, though. So quiet, I had no trouble securing your route into the reactor. You magnificent son of a bitch! Bring it in! So, where are Come the others? On, man. Jesse got hurt <laughs> and couldn't make it. Bad? Not so bad she couldn't rope in this guy. <sighs> Thanks for stepping up. It's a job. Worked out pretty good. You picking that train you did. While Shinra scours Sector 4, you can waltz right on into Sector 5. It's a bit of a squeeze, but it ought to get you where you need to go. Little dark and foreboding for my taste. Beggars can't be choosers. Oh, and you'll be needing your grappling guns, of course. All set? Ready to take on the world and then some. Make sure I think it does. Will do. You don't think so? Keep these grappling guns close. Huh. To your belt or whatever, Maybe. So when we're done, we'll be using these babies to get down safe. All of us. Got it. Oh, Tifa makes me so happy. I love her. Uh, a bit more. more to the left. The left. Wait. Hurry it up. Fix those <laughs> lights. Excuse me, sir. Your tie. Quickly now. Quickly. Hmm. Reeks of Marco. Looks like we made it. Layout's the same as Reactor One. Yeah, we're near Marco storage. Let's move. All right. So because I never um got back to you on this because I never got around to it uh, I am not like an expert in D&D lore or anything but from what I remember from what I gathered I like the dragonborn lore at least from reading their racial description I'm not seeing a way down. they uh They're, it, it's really not great lore. Like, it, it's really weird and honestly kind of problematic, I'm not going to lie. Yeah. Because apparently the Dragonborn and are the Dragonborn of D&D were like specifically bred by the dragons to be slaves probably a new prototype if they do decide to deploy it then our best bet would be to run like hell like they they are descended from dragons but they were bred specifically to be slaves which which is not great it's actually kind of the worst. But when I asked you if you preferred more so how D&D &D does Dragonborn as opposed to like Skyrim or the Elder Scrolls, I wasn't necessarily referring to their origins, but just more so the idea of Dragonborn being more draconic. 
like having more features of dragons instead of just having the soul of one. Yeah, it, it's really weird. Actually, you know what? Let me pause it and hold on. I'm going to see if I can't find... I have a fucking player's handbook around here somewhere. Let me see if I can't find that. And actually read the fucking lore off. Because I'm going to make myself look like an ass if I get this wrong. But from what I remember, it's not great. Alright, where the fuck is it? Minecraft. Superman, Batman. TMNT. Oh. How much time do you have left on your break? I don't remember. Like I said, I'm definitely not an expert. I'm just more so going off of my own memories of how the Dragonborn, like the Dragonborn racial description. Oh, no way. You're fucking lying. Where is my shit? Ain't no way. Nah, it, it, it's here somewhere. It's gotta be. Right? Like. Let's be so for real right now. Oh. Oh, damn. Is that I can't tell what that is ain't no fucking way there's no fucking way it's how is it just gone Damn. <sighs> oh, you said 10 minutes? Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna Google it. Because I can't find that fucking book anywhere. creation dragonborn were first created by dragon gods and other powerful dragons who melded the traits of humanoid races with the power of dragons the creation of the dragonborn appears to have occurred independently on multiple occasions in different worlds and by different methods tiamat the five-headed goddess of evil dragons bred twisted dragon-blooded monsters to serve her war against Bahamut, deity of good dragons. Bahamut refused to stoop to this level, but recognized the need for draconic agents of his own. He began recruiting volunteers from among the humanoid races to undergo the rite of rebirth, a ritual which transformed them into sons and daughters of Bahamut. In favor, and Bahamut unleashed the call of Bahamut, 
in the year 1359 DR, resulting in an increase in his defined rank in that world. These were not the first Dragonborn ever to walk Toril, but the existence of ancient Dragonborn had long faded by history at this point. Or by this point. In the world of Kryn, followers of the evil goddess Toxis used rituals to corrupt the heads of metallic dragons, creating a form of dragonborn known as Draconians. The desert world of Athos, the powerful sorcerer King Dragoth of uh, Wistanal, who assumed draconic form as a stepping stone to godhood, created the dragonborn over 2,000 years ago to serve him as a race of strong sorcerer mercenaries. When that city was destroyed, the survivor dragonborn became wanderers and slavers who called themselves the Drey. Okay, so I guess there's a lot of uh, different versions of D&D Dragonborn. Several other creation myths exist. One says that the dragon progenitor god, Io, created the dragonborn at the same time he created the greater dragons so that they might have a servitor race. Uh, another says that the dragonborn arose from drops of Io's blood when that god was cleaved in two with the halves forming the gods Bahamut and Tiamat. A third says that the dragonborn predate the true dragons and the Io only later created the dragons as weapons at the beginning of the Dawn War. So that's interesting. That's very interesting. I'm actually kind of glad I couldn't find the book now because I never would have gotten that if I didn't look it up. Yeah, I never would have gotten that. Okay. Think you can stop the pay train? Okay, bet. As long as I'm not hurting you or your bread. That made me very happy, you know? I don't want to interfere with none of that. Almost there. The smell. It takes me back. Back to where, Tifa? Back to where? Oh, what? You're not even going to charge there? That's awesome. The more I hear about your supervisors, the happier I am that you're working for them. Because you you need a win. You've worked in so many abusive places. Do you you really need a win? Guys. Well, well, what we got here? Turns up top. I can deal with those things. Uh, yes. 
You know, it's pretty funny, Barry. It, it really feels like you're not taking care of those fucking turns up there. It really, it really feels like you're doing more. No, you know what, Barry? You're you're gonna you're gonna piss me off. All right, listen, listen. Take care of these fucking things. Don't make me do it my damn self. Seal you up. Seal you up. There we go, girl. Hell yeah. I forget how to switch to people in the party. But that's okay. Yeah, I was gonna say, I feel like we came from over there. So it was like this last time? A little more chaotic, ain't that right? Yeah. Yeah, it was. Soldier boy. Tell him. Tifa. What? How much time we need? Got all the time in the world. This one comes with a remote detonator. Courtesy of Jesse. We withdraw to a safe distance. Then, kaboom! Hell yeah. Safe distance? What? No such thing? <laughs> we get out the same way we got in. Let's double back. Same way we got in, huh? You're huh? What, what the? Where are you going? <laughs> Weirdly perfect timing. Yeah. Wait a minute. Is someone watching us? <sighs> <sighs> Greetings, 
my dear sewer rats. As architect of our populous engagement campaign, I, Heidegger, head of public security, bid you welcome. The chief warmonger. You should be flattered. Right now, you command the undivided attention of every soul in Midgar. Huh? What is this? Breaking news from Mako Reactor 5. Shinra has confirmed the reactor to be the target of the bomb threat issued by the terrorist group Avalanche. <laughs> Members of the group were observed entering the facility, and security is currently sweeping it for explosive devices. We now go live to the scene. I'm here in the Sector 5 Undercity. Having confirmed the terrorist target, the Shinra Emergency Operations Center has issued an evacuation advisory. Residents are outraged that the tragedy of Mako Reactor 1 was only the first attack in a campaign of violence. President Shinra has issued a statement providing assurances that the terrorists will soon be brought to justice. And so, to a people beset by chaos and uncertainty, we will offer the finest comfort, bread and circus. The big boy. I give you Sidra's latest triumph of technology! The Air Buster, your executioner! Huh? <laughs> Engineering on the line. Currently, the Air Buster is only 60% operational. The estimates were optimistic. I'm on air! <laughs> to the imbecile in charge down there! You are hereby ordered to seize those intruders and bring them to me! <sighs> Come quietly and there'll be trouble! Shh. <sighs> Attention all oh, security forces! I repeat! You are the friendliest intruder on the computer! Oh, you're done! <laughs> Into Shinra's hands. The and bring yeah, them to the command and that bullshit right news now. is already peddling their false narrative. <sighs> so we're screwed. Attention, all security. No, 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 hell no! Subdue Listen, the insurgents and they want to turn this into a spectacle. Then I, I say, repeat. let's give them one. Let's take down Shinra's Subdue big ass neck in front of everybody. I like the way you think. All right, all right, let's get ready to fucking cook. Its components are still in transit. 
<laughs> we'll see about that. Could tamper a little with its loadout. And give ourselves an edge? There should be a console somewhere. This the console you're talking about? I don't know, is it? Let's check. Think you can get it to work? Needs a key card. Try that key card of yours. M units, huh? I'm guessing that's some sort of component? Yep. An enhancement powered by liquefied materia. Sounds bad. Pretty sure I can divert this unit for disposal. Disposing of M units. Removing M units from an airbuster will reduce the number of items it has at its disposal. While this does not directly affect the airbuster's tactical performance, collecting the discarded items can give your party a much needed boost in the fight. Just imagine in their faces when they find out. So far, so good. Right. Let's move. I just want to check to see if there ain't nothing I can bust up and maybe get something in. I don't see brilliating crates like that. You'd think there'd be more in a lab like this, but there's not, I guess. Fair enough, I suppose. You think they're watching us? Even now? Of yep. course they are, darling. Probably got a live feed. Nothing we can do about it. Except smile for the folks at home. You're on your own. That's fine, Bobby! See ya! Enough. Component outbound for B7. Copy. We've lost contact with B8. Send some men to check it out. We've got a schedule to keep. Huh. Intruders! Seize them! Engineering, this is B7. Grenade <laughs> 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 out! Negative B7. Airbus delivered priority. You're on your own. Happy. That's that. Then we'll deal with you ourselves! Looks like there's two consoles this time. <laughs> Double the sabotage. If we can find the key cards. Okay, that's a one. Any cards? Just the one. Two choices. And only one single use card. It's up to you, Cloud. Well, hold on. <laughs> Calm down. Let, let's relax here. Ooh. That'll come in handy. Oh fuck, maybe Tifa was right. Maybe they were yeah. Only one card. Ain't that about a bitch. <coughs> They're telling me none of the motherfuckers we just dropped had a fucking key card on them. All right, let's take a look. Let's see what's what going on here. What does an AI programming core do? Increases processing power dedicated to motor function computation. Makes it move real quick. A real quick giant robot, huh? That doesn't sound good. Anyway, we should weigh our options carefully. Yeah. 
disposing of AI programming cores. Removing an Airbuster's programming core hampers its tactical awareness and reduces the frequency with which it fires its finger beams. An attack that stuns targets. Okay. Not yet. I think I'll probably choose this one, but I still want to see what this console is over here, if it's for M units or not. Console talks about big bomber shells. You acquainted? We call them BBs. One's enough to blow you to hell and back. Could divert them and give it a couple less shots to take us out. Make the call. Dispose of big bombers. Removing the big bombers from an airbuster will reduce the number of big bomber shells that it has at its disposal. Big bomber shells hit your party hard. The fewer shells fired your way, the safer your party will be. Hmm. What do you think, Koa? Should I go with slowing it down or taking out the its bombs? Because I know well, taking out because I know slowing it down will also reduce the number of times it'll. Uh, shoot that laser which apparently stuns and you know how much I hate yeah that's what I was thinking because you know how much I hate crowd control now, honestly yeah I don't think it'll have enough opportunities to really get the bombs off frequently enough to really kill us because we've got a lot AI of potions and faster, right? yeah divert it or not Programming core flat for disposal. I was thinking the same thing. So, where did we send the discarded stuff? To a storeroom for defective equipment, I'm guessing. That's so. You think these defective shells and programming cores might be valuable enough to warrant a little detour? Maybe. I say we grab them. Hmm. If we get that far. I like Barrett. He he's he's really growing on me. I mean, I never flat out disliked him, but. Everything Shinra has told you is a goddamn lie. Marco is the lifeblood of our planet. Those greedy bastards are bleeding it dry. Y'all gotta rise up. Barrett, who are you talking to? The people put me on TV. I'm gonna drop some truth. Damn straight. They cut the sound. Also true. Cloud's definitely not wrong here. Yeah, no. Nope, 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 nope. I refuse. Barret. There you go. Yeah, fuck those things. No time to celebrate. <laughs> sure there is. Wait, hold on. Alright, yeah, let's start healing. Um, first of all. Hold on. Let me hit this real quick. Hmm. 
I think that should be good. Got any more crates full of goodies around here? I've never flat out disliked Barry. I think he he's got so probably my only issue with Barry is how he is at just in general at the beginning, and it's not that it's and it's cards? not that it's not an understandable three choices. issue because it is understandable I do see where it's coming from but it's kind of the same reason I also dislike cloud at the beginning because I just feel like they are a lot rougher than they probably need to be like I understand you need to be passionate to be an eco activist to be any sort of activist but especially when you're doing big shit like this you have to be a hardened and you have to be super passionate and actually care about what you're doing but he just felt too much of a hard ass for me and it's the same thing with, like, Cloud when we first meet Cloud, too. Like, Cloud's a dick when we first meet him. And it's really fucking annoying. And Barrett kind of has that same issue. Although not nearly as bad as Cloud does. Because you can see when it comes to, like, the rest of Avalanche and shit. That he's generally pretty warm and pretty friendly but it with cloud even when it comes to like tifa he can be he can still be cold and rude and it's very irritating i guess i'm just kind of tired of all that like there's so much cynicism in the world and in everyone today that i just don't have the time or not the time but the patience to really tolerate anyone being rude for like no reason hell is this m unit another type of enhancement you call if you want to nix it mm. Is it all going to be the same thing? Is it going to be M units? Oh yeah, for sure. Like I said, it's not like even that. I don't. Hurry up and decide what you want to get rid of. It's past time we taught Shinra a lesson. Like it's not that I don't understand where either of them are coming from. Like I do empathize and I get it for sure. It's just more so like. I'm just tired of it, especially because, like you said, not only is it ever present hey, in cool. real life, hmm. it's what also like we. we... I think I'll do the bomber this time. It's everywhere. You really can't escape it. From what you said, even one big bomber shell is too many, but I'll let you be the judge of that. Yeah. The 
I guess the best way to put it is even though I don't necessarily dislike Barrett or even really Cloud for that matter, it's more so something like I don't always have the social battery or the spoons to deal with people like them. Like, when it comes to personalities that I could vibe with, like, 100% of the time, it's people like you and Majora, or, you know, when it comes to, like, character personalities that I really like, there's obviously Tifa, there's Jesse. Um, Noctis is probably my favorite Final Fantasy protagonist because of how much I love his personality. It's amazing. And the people who like to act like he's Discount Sasuke are fucking stupid. Just because he looks like Sasuke doesn't make him even remotely I similar to what, Sasuke. I never look forward to an execution more in my entire life. <laughs> <laughs> you don't say. We're about to make fools out of Shinra while the whole damn city's watching. Hell yeah. <laughs> Times like these, you gotta save them. Oh, oh no. yeah, from if you're Twitter. To ask me to dance, then don't. Come on, don't be shy. How about you, Cloud? I don't dance. See this motherfucker? Like, come on. You can at least vibe. I guess I'm just. Tired of party poopers is probably the best way to put it. Like, I. Like, I'm more inclined to be around people who I can vibe with now. B5, this is engineering. You need to pick up the pace. We're running dangerously low on components because of those terrorists. Copy. They're here! Let's finish. Enough. Bunch of pushovers. Come on, y'all. Let's see what kind of mischief they were getting up to. I also want to see if there's any good crates. Oh, are you talking about his games thread? Four consoles. And never enough key cards. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure what his logic was for a lot of them. But I don't think it was necessarily talking about the games themselves, at least not for all of them. Because when I said something about like WoW being on there, eh, he was like, he said uh, it was more about the, he said it was more about like WoW players than actually WoW itself. This is our chance to really stick it to Shinra. We should think it through before we make a decision. Yeah, I just don't think M units are a big enough drop to really it justify it. We should divert them if you think it'll improve our odds. What's the fourth one, though? An AI programming core. Should we discard this or something else? Uh, 
Oh, two programming cores? He he's a good guy. I think he's just passionate and very opinionated. can at least it's all good the stage is set all that's left is to hijack Heidegger's show still not good fucking goody grits god damn it oh well oh wait I'm blind <laughs> Up on the exit. Tifa, detonator still in range? We should be good. The moment Big Boy goes down, you hit that switch. Right. Don't even think of it. Why would I? Gloves up. Sure thing, coach. That's just self care. In this day and age, I honestly cannot fathom why anyone wouldn't just start muting and blocking people. Okay, so do we go? Okay. We gotta go the other way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that. I got that. The only way with a console. Got it. Can't say we oh yeah, for prepare. sure. Now we just gotta get it done. Especially because bigots and just horrible people are fucking everywhere nowadays, man. It's crazy. Status report. We're making our final adjustments. Work faster, or you'll hear it from the brass. <clears throat> Look, they're still prepping it. They're here. Hold them back. Buy us every second you can. <laughs> nope, I am on your ass, sir. Oh damn, I'm just wasting my shit. Hey guys. How is he not reacting? I think it's more so just be I think it's just scripted. 
I think he's immortal. Looks like a performance assessment, don't you think? Reduced response time. Should work in our favor. For real though, we need to talk victory poses. Something coordinated for the live on camera finish. Could <laughs> blow up big. Start a new trend. Vito. See this fucking huh? cloud. No way up. Are you just allergic to fun? Is that what's going on here? Okay. Okay, so we do get upgrades. Let's go. What else we got? Hmm. Let's check to see. Eight? Okay. Heard you. Chris's mats on P. Chris's mats HP. Hmm. New material slot. Oh. I don't really know which one I wanted him to do now. I think I'll do the Matt's HP for now. And we'll do this. Okay. And bear it. Do that. This max HP. There's already two slots on here, so I'm not gonna waste on that. I don't know if you guard often enough to justify that. Buff duration. Sure, I think we'll do that. Debuff resistance. Hmm. Okay, so we'll do this one. Okay, we'll do the attack. Okay. Then I'll have to equip him with that and some materia. Are, are you, I don't remember what you're equipped with. Are you equipped with the metal gloves? Because the leather gloves have more. Okay, you're equipped with the with the metal. Got you. Oh yeah, that's what the fucking little E symbol is there, where you fucking dunce. Okay, so what all are we missing here? Oh, like, most of it. Heard you, heard you. Yeah, actually most of it. Um, speed is whatever. Why? What? What are we talking? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Ah, 
how she doesn't have another one that's gonna help her get more HP is insane to me. Probably get more useful buff material for you later. Not cleansing material for you. Oh, you've already got two cures? Okay, never mind. It's kind of a waste. Hold on. I guess we will do the lightning material for you then. You, what do you mean you've already got one? Where? What are you talking about? On what? Whatever. It works. Wait, we probably gotta go this way, don't we? No way we're getting back up that pipe. Keep looking. We were going to bring the trap in with it. Okay, yeah, nothing over here. There's stuff over here, though. A chest. Let's go. Not going down without a letter. Enough. All done. Huh. Cocky little bastard, ain't you?
We're gonna get through this. We're gonna make it home. All of us. No exceptions. Right. Damn straight. We don't want to disappoint Marlene. That goes for you too, Cloud. Right? You better give her a big old smile this time. If the price is right. <laughs> See this motherfucker. Like, granted, maybe that was a joke. But still, like, come on. I understand it probably was, because I don't think Cloud is that unhinged. But also, you never know. You know what I'm saying? Where did we come from over here? Like, what is Oh, I'm a dumbass. What? Open it already. It's locked down. Is there any way we can get it open? Yeah, from that room over there. Why does everything have to be so damn complicated? You know, Cause the fuck me. Storerooms that way too. Do you think we'll find the components we diverted there? It's like a treasure vault. Woo, I like the sound of that. Yeah, there. We could have also just busted the so fucking door do down. We do this? It's simple, really. We move the levers at the same time. Got these ones. I'll take left, which just leaves right, soldier boy. Tell him. Locks can be disabled by simultaneously operating levers located on the security panels. Baron Cloud's levers are operated by using the left stick and right stick respectively. At Tifa's signal, push left and right in the direction shown on the display. Emergency Heard you. lockdown is currently in effect. So we need to synchronize our movements? In that case, follow my lead. Nah, Tifa's. Fine, have it your way. Okay, pay attention you two. Three, two, one. Emergency lockdown disengaged. Hell yeah! <laughs> we really did it! Great timing. Right on the money. Yeah. See, man, if you don't fucking high five if her cute that? ass. She's just trying to celebrate with you and this would be the treasure vault. That's right. What's the catch? We need to bypass a high-level security lock. Different from the other one? Same deal. But we gotta do it several times. Ha! Not a problem. Yeah, let's try. Alright. Oh, we gotta go to this one. Heard you. Delta-level security lockdown is currently in effect. Okay, guys. You know what we have to do. Copy me? No, Tifa leads. Oh, fine. After you, girl. Gotta get past level one first, right? Three, two, one. Oh, no way. Mother! Shake it off. Three, two, one. Alpha level security disengaged. That was great, you guys. Let's keep it up. <laughs> All right. Three, two, one. Beta level security. There we go. Wow. Think we've got this? Hell yeah. Bring it on. Ain't nothing I love more than sticking it to shit. I heard that. Halfway there. Steady, guys. Three, two, one. Gamma level security. Disengage. No way! <laughs> you guys are naturals. Okay, final round. Don't lose focus. Three, two, one. There we go. Delta level security. Disengaged. Disposal room now accessible. Take that, Shinra. Making us jump through hoops to steal your shit. <laughs> Didn't take as long as I expected. Good work, guys. 
Likewise. You made it easy. <laughs> I put my heart and soul into those countdowns. Oh, I'm sure you did. Like, I understand if she's not your favorite, but I don't understand how people can't. How there are people out there who legitimately don't like Tifa. It's very interesting to me. Like, you have to genuinely be, like, a woman-hating misogynist to not like Tifa. Was, was that it? No way. Oh. Yes, sir. I say, well, I forget about Zach, but I say Cloud doesn't deserve Tifa. Be considered being less of a cunt, then you know, maybe I'd change my mind. But as it stands, he can go fuck himself. Okay, so where am I going this way? Oh, hey, yeah, let's do this real quick. Oh, I see. <coughs> sure, I'll buy one. There's 1500. I don't think we'll need one yet, but I'll buy them out just in case. That's odd, but okay. And we did all that. Now all that's left is to do what? <laughs> do I got anything left to drink? Nope, I'm gonna have to go get some water. Yeah, after this boss, I'm probably gonna wrap it up. And go get some water. Right, get some food. Huh? Huh? Look! Huh. I'm not feeling great today. Soldier. Once a soldier, always a soldier. Though not, alas, for very long. Accelerated cellular degradation being the most common cause of death by far. This is classified. Yeah, it's not great. My throat's like closing up and shit. That's right. 
I'm feeling a lot better than I did when I first woke up, but... Ain't enough hours in the day to hold you to account for all your crimes. And what a wasteful indulgence it would be, even if there were. Okay then. Let's talk about wasteful indulgences. What is Marco? The life stream. The lifeblood of the planet. Our planet. But Shinra keeps on slurping it up like a thirsty dog. What do you think's gonna happen if you don't stop, huh? Yeah, that's my plan. I don't know if y'all could hear in my voice, but I am struggling to speak coherently. The true nature of Marco is known to one and all, yet the people willfully turn a blind eye to the costs. As you must surely be aware. Don't you dare try to put this on us! If anyone's going along with your plans, it's cause you brainwashed them! Such methods are beneath me. As are you, my faithful sewerettes. Henceforth, allies of wicked Wutai, our sworn enemy. Thank you for stoking our people's patriotic fervor. Wutai! The hell we are! Yeah. You still don't understand your role in this. What are they doing? Don't you see? You fools were never in control. Never anything but pawns in our plans to sell great and glorious war to the people. Oh, yes, of course. Instruments of insurrection will detonate. Uh. When we so choose. God damn it. Now let us raise the curtain on our main event. The trial of the eco extremist group Avalanche. Terrorists who conspired with Mutai against Midgar. Your guilt is undeniable. Your punishment, death. Hell yeah, girl. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of all of this. It's just like it, Lord. But I failed you. Failed you. Cloud! Get your head in the game! We're counting on you, man. Cloud, are you alright? I'm fine. You guys should go. As good as I'll ever be, the Ah, uh, no, you know what? Um, it depends. If I get party wiped, yeah. But I shouldn't. Oh damn, I only got MP like that right now? Heard you, heard you. Let me get an ether. Back. 
Okay, so we're going to do that real quick. Hit me. The Kira. Let's go with the focus thrust. Abilities. Hit the left arm. past like half of a week fifteen hundred I don't need fifteen hundred but I will do this twice Let's go, Ifrit. Get him. Well, I can't do much shit right now, then. Coming at you. 
Damn. Or not, I guess. Damn. Probably can't hit my limit breaker right here. That's fine. Um. Abilities. Stay uh, yeah, that's true. I'm really happy to, like, I am very, very happy. All right, let's limit break this motherfucker. Oh damn, you don't got nothing. Got Come on, guys, bring it on. Let's show them what we made of. Yeah, we we really gotta call more and just hang out more. It sucks that this is the longest we've hung out out in so long. Here we go. We don't have long to get clear. Take Tifa and get out of here. I, I was wrong about you. This ain't the end of the line for you or me. Cloud! Come on! <laughs> Do you know if Dragon's Dogma 2 is cross compatible? Like if I got it, it would I be able to hire your pawns and vice versa? Because I know you play on PC, but I don't have a strong enough PC to be able to run something like that. 
Not yet, at least. So it'd have to be either on my Xbox or my PS5. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. You okay? You okay? Yeah. Made it through with just a couple of scraped knees back then. Back then? What do you say? We doing this? Have we? Hell yeah. Right now, That's dope. You need to focus on yourself. Move something. Anything. Why not? Good. Easy does it. Slow. Slow. And steady. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, who are you? <laughs> who are you? I am your everything. <gasps> Hello in there. Oh, Cloud. There's still so much to be done. What's RC? Maybe you're not okay. Hey, hi, darling. I love Aerith too. I, everyone in this game is oh, great. He lives. Finally awake, are we? <coughs> you're Aerith. It's Aerith. And you are? Cloud. Nice to meet you again. Again, huh? What? You don't remember? What about the flowers? Oh, the flower girl. And this is... An old church in the Sector 5 slums. You came crashing through the roof without so much as a lookout below. <laughs> Fell right into my flower bed. Lucky for okay, you. Okay, got you, got you. Like, really? Rift Crystal so, sorry, sounds like a League of Legends it. currency. They're a lot tougher than they look. This place, it has a kind of power. Before I forget, you dropped this when you landed. Thanks. I've got one too. You and everybody and their mother. Not like mine, no. It's special. Mine's not good for anything at all. <laughs> Bet you just don't know how to use it. Could be. Though, I really don't mind. Just having it is enough. It was a gift from my mother. Pretty crazy, huh? Us meeting again like this. You should stay a while. <sighs> All right, y'all. I'm going to get up on out of here. Uh, get some food and rest. Um, yeah. Uh, for anyone who jumped in, like, halfway through the stream or whatever, uh, this will be a VOD up on my channel here soon. I just, uh, I'm getting ready to upload and drop the VOD to my third stream, which was last week Thursday. Um... Other than that, that's it. Uh, I will see y'all next week. I've been Lulu. You've been whoever the hell you are. And, uh, yeah. Bye.